Hello folks! So, um, last time in Space Haven, everything seemed to be going quite well. Um, however, in episode 4 we'll have to address a big problem that started to crop up. I mean, in the fact that we need to make new things using tech blocks, but we haven't actually got any. And unfortunately the way to actually set up a production chain to make tech blocks requires tech blocks. So we're in a bit of a catch-22 here. And we also need to sort out the farm situation because we're supposed to have carbon dioxide in here and we never set that up. We also never um, planted all the vegetables that we need to do. But I don't think actually we need- we probably don't need a second one, really. It's just the fact that the, the first one is growing really badly because we don't have a sealed carbon dioxide environment, but we can't really do that just yet because to make the carbon dioxide thing we need tech blocks and we're running very low on that at the moment. But what we'll do is, um, to actually get around the tech blo blocks problem, is we'll start dismantling things that we don't need um, to actually claim some tech blocks back. For one thing, let's not worry about the energy refinery, let's just cancel that completely for now and try to focus on getting the tech blocks into the chemical refinery. And also, we need to build a... I think it's an optronics doodad. Hang on, where is it? The optronics fabricator, and also an advanced assembler. And all those three things combined will allow us to make tech blocks. But we'll need to start dismantling a few things here and there. Right, let's go to the jukebox. We don't want that. That'll give us back a tech block. And we could start dismantling the engines as well. Here's Here's another thing we could do. Uh, dismantle one or both of these power generators and replace it with one bigger one, maybe. That'll give us back loads of tech blocks, because having two small ones is very inefficient. We need one big one. Um, so, might do that. The trouble is, uh, we, we, um, we'd, have inter we'd have our power interrupted for a while, and I'm a bit concerned about that. So, i say what I really could do is just start dismantling things like the, all these things in here. I'll probably leave the engine. But, I mean, here we've got well, hyperdrive does actually have two tech blocks in it. But the hill stabilizer needs two, and the ops and the navigation things all have two in them as well. So I'm mindful. What I could do, here's what we'll do, is we'll leap, we'll use the engines to leap somewhere in, in the system, because we've mined this out last time. Like, we'll move to wherever there's good, re good resources, maybe down there. And then once we've done that, then we'll dismantle the engines temporarily. Or, I say the engines, but the, the bits and bobs anyway. So let's do this. Let's actually start um, preparing to go. So they won't be able to go outside, but who cares? Uh, meanwhile, they're, they're still building these walls here. Uh, if we're, if we're going to build these two new facilities um, in the light industrial area, the ops and the uh, the advanced th um, assembler, we will actually have to expand this room a bit more, possibly over there. And does, yeah, what I was thinking about doing here is putting the, the new power generator in there, rather than the hypersleep stuff, which can wait. And that'll also, like, free up this space for more important stuff, and stop the the uh, the penalties for discomfort of the power generators bleeding out into the environment. I think if we keep that towards the edge of the ship, that might be a good idea. And also make sure that we do have room for a nice large thing. Anyway, are we now ready to go? Dr. Rooney is at the control, so he might actually be ready to go. Right, let's move on. Away from the gunk. So we can either go down or up. Um, I don't know what's there, and there is not particularly very interesting stuff. Let's go over here, and then over to here. So, uh, just to, I, mean, I didn't really make it clear at all in previous episodes, but it's it's the green balls that we're using here. Every one of these jumps uh, within the system costs one ball, and we haven't got any way of making new green balls yet until we get some green fuel, which we haven't actually seen yet. We've only got the blue, the blue ore fuel down here, which makes the everyday power fuel rods. So let's go over to here. Oh, there's nothing there. There's literally no resources here. But there is here. So let's go there and drop into wherever the hell we are. It'll take a bit of time. Everyone's still carrying out their duties. Deploy. So this will have noble metals and ice. Nothing particularly exciting. But it does mean that now we're here, we can dismantle all the gunk. Dismantle. Dismantle. And dismantle. I think that should be safe. I hope it's safe. <laughs> if not, oh dear. That'll give us the tech blocks we need. But we don't actually need... Well, first of all, we actually need to expand the... The ship. I think it's going to have to be... Kind of over here-ish. It's going to have a bit of a knob jewel in the side of the ship here, but never mind. I'll also be expanding this bit. Um, this is where the... Um, the new power generator is going to be. We'll need even more walls. Right, so that'll expand that. We'll also need to move things around. Like, there's a light situation. We'll probably have to 
move that to somewhere else. Let's move that. Can we move that over? Mm. I think maybe dismantling it would be better. And I'll put in a... At some point I'll put in a new light. I'll worry about that later. Well, Dr. Rooney is getting busy and finishing off the last of the walls. So one thing I'm doing with this room, because we need, because I want to seal it up at some point, uh, I will probably um, delete this wall and put a wall in... Oh, delete the door and put a wall in there and have a new door access from... Well, I suppose it'll have to be over here, won't it? So that'll mean we'll, this'll be sealable and people won't need to walk through it, the, 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 the carbon dioxide room, to get to wherever. But it looks like, food-wise, I'm hoping that we will get enough food before we deplete all our space food, our pre-existing space food. And it should happen. Oh, dear. Yeah, no. It was a situation. <laughs> yeah. But we really need to concentrate on expanding the ship over here. So they'll all do, all do... Oh, there we go. We actually have got one lad out there doing that. Right, so okay, so we, we got all our resources back. I mean, we don't lose anything from dismantling. All the original resources should theoretically be there. And it does mean that we are now have five tech blocks. Um, we have to spend them wisely. It does mean that one of the tech blocks we reclaimed has now gone into making the chemical refinery. So that's now officially um, ready to build. It's not built yet, but the, the, the final tech block has been added to that. And um, so that's one thing in the chain we'll need. This is being built, so let's build a bit more wallage. So everything's nice and secure. Uh, we'll put in a door here, I think. So yeah, this will be the new power room. Let's um, dismantle that in preparation. Oh, here we go. Angry Leahy's done the building job. Uh, let's just keep on going quite fast. There are pirates in this game, apparently, that can ambush you and start firing on you. Thankfully, we haven't actually met any yet. What's this? Needs matching console. Yeah, 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 don't worry about that. Oh, the, oh here we go. Look, there's some... Um, the new power room is now built. Oh, yeah, I completely forgot about that. <laughs> oh, well, we could have talked to them. We could have traded. We could have possibly got some tech blocks out of them. I don't know. Right, so that's now finished being built, so let's quickly burn up a new wall. And we've got a brand new, lovely, lovely room here. So this, what I'll do is I'll close the vent on this door. I think I can just click on it. I won't do it just yet, but... And then we will then we can build a carbon dioxide generator, and then everything should be groovy in there. I say, I'm waiting for a, t a spare tech block, though, before that happens. So we nearly have got this sorted, so what we'll do is be working out exactly... What can go where? Can it probably squeeze in there? This power thing probably needs to be moved. I'm not quite sure where yet. Um, Uptronics Fabricator, how big is this? I mean, this could do with going kind of like there-ish. Let's put in a, a new power node. So that's going to be... I think putting it kind of there... Oh, it's really difficult to say. Put it up there. Mm, we'll see. I just need to get rid of this one, because it's just in the way. But let's erect... Um, I'll, I'll erect everything and then worry about the... Yeah. I can... I'll, I'll dismantle that in a second. Yeah, just sorry. Dismantle. And we'll worry about this in the morning. I suppose we should pay attention to the ship. Let's trade. See what they see what they want. See what they can sell. They could, well, they, they, they could sell us um, or Hyperium or, um, exotic crystals that we can turn into new green balls. But I probably don't really care for for that right now. They want super blocks. They want a lot of things. They can't have it. What's this? Monster meat? Hmm, it's tempting, actually, because... But I'm sure we'll solve our food situation quite soon. Uh, I don't really see the need to trade here. Right, okay, so what are we doing? We're waiting for people to finish building this. Well, that should be okay, though. We don't need to worry about that. Okay, I'm going to pause it just for a sec. And let's try to arrange everything in as nice a way as possible. 
We need to make sure that they can actually get past. I think... Is there enough room there? I think so. I believe that's okay. And we need the advanced thingamy. I can probably go... Let's put that there. It makes more efficient use. That means we can also put something there if necessary. And then we'll definitely need some lighting. Where's that? Was that going to go that way? Or? No, sorry. Yeah. yeah. I'm tempted to put this in the middle, but... Oh, actually, I know what I'll do. Put it there. Now, hopefully that should all work. Yeah, that's all nicely finished now. So we've still got four whole blocks left, so that's all good. I think they've been making it. And we've got... We've only got two tech blocks now, because I think we've everything's been moved into position. But it looks like... In theory, oh, that still needs two tech blocks. Oh, it needs, we still need four. We've only got two. Hmm, I'm a bit, I'm a bit concerned here. I'm sure I'll be fine. Oh, that needs to be linked. Oh, hello. That's a problem. <laughs> ah, right. Well, fine. We'll have to put. Another one somewhere. The power generator is going to be in here. Let's do that. Sod it. So those are the only unreachable areas. So this is this should be okay. It should all be fine. I hope. Right, this has been done. So now we can link everything up finally. Boop boop. There we go. We'll need more lighting probably here and all. One tech block left. We've actually have we built this thing now? Yes, we have. The advanced assembler is now built. Uh, so we can turn the infra block and the optronics components into tech blocks. However, we don't have the optronic components yet because we're still waiting for one more tech block. Oh, we actually have got it. I think it's because it's not in storage. It didn't count as a number. I think it was just lying around on the floor. So I think we have actually got enough now. So let's high, con high priority that. Yep, yeah, I think Carol Klein is now gathering. Oh no, she's just doing logistics. So someone is going to do this. The tech block has been moved. So someone, hopefully, maybe it's Dr. Rooney. I think Dr. Rooney is now bringing the last tech block. Ah, and there we go. So now, hopefully we can make the damn thing. Why aren't you on the, the bloody grid? Are you just like one... Ah, the machine's one away. No, oh, bloody hell. Fine. Should put it on the floor. <laughs> God damn it. Hmm. I'll put it... That's on the floor here, I think. That's really annoying. What a waste. Fine. Then we can set up all the bills that we need. Here we go. Link. 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 <laughs> what a terrible bloody waste. Never mind. Right. So now we can do this. Finally. Optronics. Continuous? Oh, we haven't made the chemical stuff yet. Oh god, we have to set up that first. Right. Chemical refinery. Continuous. So we'll make chemicals, and then we can turn the chemicals into this. Make it continuous. Uh, and then we can make as many blocks as we can. Tech blocks. Right, okay, so those haven't got the resources yet because we haven't made the chemicals. Uh, we sh I could actually be sending people out to do the mining, so I'll do that. I'll just do it all. There we go. Now, there isn't a derelict in this system, so we don't have to worry about that. Now, I haven't got any tech blocks. As soon as, I'm, as, soon as I get more tech blocks, I think I'll, um, I'll erect a nice, big, fat, juicy power thing there. These have got four power blocks in them each. And the larger ones will either need five or six, depending on the size. Uh, yeah. We also need to sort out the carbon dioxide thing so we can make sure that the food doesn't deplete too much. Uh, and we also need to rebuild all this stuff. We really do need these tech blocks. And fortunately, everyone's about to go to bed. Also asleep, let's um, sort out a couple of things that I've been meaning to do. Uh, 
life support. I think it's really cold in the lounge, so I thought I might give them a treat. Look, it's down to 14 degrees, which is not great. Also, it's, it's really cold in here, in the light industry area, so a couple of extra heaters might be useful. Put one in there, turn it around, and another one in here. There, that should do the trick. So in theory, there's more tech blocks we could get by dismantling stuff. I don't really want to. You could get one from the tools facility, but as soon as you do that, you'll run out of tools very fast. Uh, the, the water purifier is... I could get one tech block out of that, but at the moment, I'd rather just get the, get the, uh, the tech sorted. Oh god. Oh dear. We are using up too much power. We're only generating 14. Have we got any... I think we may have not got any... Huh? <gasps> We're out of energy rods. Bugger. And we can't make any more. Damn it. Okay, hang on. This is a major problem. Offers... They don't offer any... No. They want... Energium. We've got Energium, but we haven't got any way of turning it into... Power rods yet. Hmm. This is a major problem. Ah, so we haven't got the tech blocks to build the bloody thing, and we haven't really got much of that in the f to actually turn into it anyway. Um, let's just remind ourselves: energy refinery to make the fuel requires three tech blocks. Aye, aye, aye. Maybe we will need to dismantle things after all. The trouble is we won't be able to use the damn thing because we won't have any power. Have to think about this. So at the moment the only thing I can do is hastily attempt to recycle some energy scrap as a high priority thing. Because that'll give us very small amounts of energy rods. It's just not going to be enough. But we need to be able to make more. There's a Mechanism for setting out a distress beacon, but not quite sure we can actually do that just yet. Maybe you have to be more distressed than I am. So we're going to have to call this a loss. Um, I'm not going to run it down to the last second or whatever, but I've, um, I've been trying to play around with ways of trying to get it to work, and I don't think I can, um, sadly. And because, well, I could re try to try again from the start of the episode, um, tr concentrating on trying to make... Uh, the fuel, but then I'd have to use all the tech blocks for that, and I'd still probably have to dismantle everything. And we wouldn't really have much fuel to convert anyway, so I think we've just worked ourselves into a bit of a corner, unless unless you can suggest differently, but unfortunately we will have to call this here. And next time I shall make sure that I know exactly where I'm going to be going with all the various things from the start, and I'll be able to plan ahead and not get caught up in this. <laughs> I just wasn't keeping an eye out on the power at all. And next time I won't make two small generators as well. That was silly. Okay, so that's been Space Haven. It's quite cool. I like it. Um, I want to do more of just like spaceship design, really, if nothing else. Um, it's, that's the, my favourite part of it, just um, designing your own ship and trying to get efficient logistics going on. But it uh, turns out it's actually quite hard getting everything set up in the first place. <laughs> yeah, so thanks for watching. Do um, check out the rest of my stuff. Subscribe to the channel to be notified when new stuff goes live. Uh, and um, I'll see you next time. Bye for now.